Do you guys call tables? Do you guys have to like call tables that part of your job? I feel like that that might be that might be a thing. I don't know. You know, you gotta like call table one to the buffet, table two to the buffet, calling tables. Well, I was asked to call tables recently, and I figured this would be. I've never talked about this before because I don't do it often, but I do have some opinions on this. You tell me if you do this all the time, you tell me what you think, but this is my personal opinion on it. I figured I'd give you guys a couple tips with calling tables, okay? So, my first tip when it comes to calling tables is to not call them at all, okay? <laughs> with the mic, I mean. Do not use your mic. I think, personally, call me crazy. But I think if you call a table number on a mic, that is the most tacky thing in the world. You sound like the bingo guy, like the, like this shit right here, or this shit right here. I can never point the right way. I'd be a terrible weatherman. You literally sound like the bingo guy. Table one, you could go to the buffet. Table two, you could go to the buffet. And then, like, if you have eighteen tables, like, do you, do you like use different ad libs? You do like different adjectives that, like, do you or do you just say the same thing? Table three. Buffet, you know, it's just, it's terrible. I think it's the most tacky thing in the world. If I get asked to call tables, right? The rare moment I do, I always go up to them personally. Okay. That's the major key. You go up to the table. You say, Hey, listen, it's your turn. I hope you're hungry. Help yourself to the buffet. Bam. Table one gone. Table two, go up to them. Hey guys, how you doing? So whenever you can, whenever you're down or whatever, what do I say? Say, hey, hey guys, how you doing? Whenever you're ready, feel free to head up to the buffet. You're all set. Bam. Do it personally. When you do it on the mic, it's super, super tacky. Okay. It, it just, it, I don't care where your wedding is. I don't care like what kind of wedding, you, you know, whatever level. It doesn't matter. It's still a wedding. It's a formal event. It's a big, it, every wedding's a Super Bowl. You don't do anything tacky. There's no reason. Just get out from behind the booth, okay? Put on a song that's like four or five minutes long. You don't even need it. It takes you 30 seconds to get to a table, say, go up there. That's it. Call them personally, okay? The second rule I always go by when it comes to calling tables is, of course, and I'm many of you, if you call tables, you know this, you always have to do family and the important people first. So, you know, that's the trickiest part. You know, when they told me last minute I was at a wedding and they were like, hey, you got to call tables. It was like right before dinner. I was like, shit. The first thing I had to figure out was like who the important people are, right? So now I'm looking, I'm like, all right, I'm trying to remember from intros and everything. <laughs> you know, you got to figure out where the family seated, where the bridal party seated, where all the important people are because they got to go up first because back in the day, I, I messed that up and I, I just went from table one on and like table nine was where the parents were and they got so mad at me. It was like years and years and years ago. I was still a teenager, I think. I was like 17 or 18 years old. And yeah, and I just, I kind of just said, so, all right, table one first, I just did it in order and the mom came up to me and was like, um, excuse me, I'm paying for this wedding and you're calling up these tables to eat before me? And I'm like, that's a good point. <laughs> she, was, she was absolutely pissed at me. Pissed with a capital T. Pissed. And I, you know, I apologize and all that and uh, never let that happen again. So, you know, those are my rules with calling a table. A quick little one, but yeah, that, that, don't do it on the mic. Just, just, just don't be lazy. Go up and tell the table yourself and then make sure you identify who the important people are and get them up first, you know, and then, and then it doesn't matter. Then, you know, all the regular people, all the, uh, all the fluff can, uh, can go up whenever. But, um, yeah. <laughs>